you go through different stages as you learn about shark calling. First, what shark calling actually is and the methods that are used. From there, you begin to understand the manner of death suffered by the animals that are captured. which leads to learning which animals are being captured and which ones aren't. And when you realize how many species are impacted, you wonder how effective these methods are at accomplishing their goals. which in turn leads to looking at the history of calling and whether or not it has ever accomplished its goals or if there has been progress, innovation or improvements in the near century of implementation. And if not, why? And finally, after discovering the answers to all of these questions, you're left wondering if the real monsters are below the surface or above it.